Ten days from now is the one-year anniversary when Russia brutally, illegally, and in a completely unprovoked way invaded the sovereign nation of Ukraine. As the Secretary just pointed out, Putin thought he could defeat Ukraine quickly, fracture the NATO alliance, and act with impunity. He was wrong. Ukraine remains free. They remain independent. NATO in this coalition has never been stronger, and Russia is now a global pariah, and the world remains inspired by Ukrainian bravery and resilience. In short, Russia has lost. They've lost strategically, operationally, and tactically, and they are paying an enormous price on the battlefield. But until Putin ends his war of choice, the international community will continue to support Ukraine with the equipment and capabilities it needs to defend itself. Through this group, we are collectively supporting Ukraine's ability to defend its territory, protect its citizens, and liberate their occupied areas. In the face of a barbaric Russian invasion, Ukrainians remain resilient. The nation of Ukraine is united for one single purpose, to expel the Russian forces from their territory and to defend themselves. For Ukraine, this is not a war of aggression. It is a war of defense.